we start Jamal Adams' dominance with this. He is the best edge run support safety in the NFL. He plays the edge better than anybody. Watch this against the Colts. Uh, running back, supposed to be up the A-gap, bounces it to the outside. Adams is there on the edge. Here it is from the end zone view in slow motion. First of all, Avery Williamson fills the hole. I don't know if it's a run blitz or he reacted, but he fills the hole. Here's Adams on the right side. His purpose here is to pinch it as far down as possible, playing the in his inside shoulder. Nothing could get outside of him. If he, if he allows the running back to get outside, he has failed. He needs to pinch it down. Look at how he, how he comes to the point of attack and challenges. If he waits, there would be so much room for the running back to run through, but he doesn't. He meets him, plays it with his inside shoulder, forces the fumble, and that run support Jamal Adams, man, he is just too good. More edge play from Jay Adams here. First down at the eight yard line, 0-0 ball game. It's a man, obviously, because look at the switching there. The corner stays with the receiver. Jamal heads over to the strong side. Boom. You can see a little bit. He cuts off the edge. It's almost like he's blitzing, but he's really not blitzing. Here it is from the end zone view. Switches to the strong side. The, the wide side becomes the strong side, thanks to the motion. And he has the edge set on the right. Copeland pinches. Adams lunges and makes a beautiful tackle on Lindsay, the rook. To start, I labeled Adams the best edge run support safety in the NFL. Here's an example of not that. Yes, he's playing the edge. He's the eighth man in the box. Seventh man, because it's nickel. And he sets the edge there, and Lindsay gets through. Denver Broncos running back uh, Lindsay. But did you see the hustle by Adams? Here it is. Jordan Jenkins has the first edge. He sets the edge. He makes the mistake of not pinching it enough. He gets pushed back too far to the wide side. So this makes Jamal Adams too far to the wide side too. He can't pinch it. See, there's Jenkins stringing it, stringing it, stringing it. He gets pushed too far. So there's way too much C-gap space for Lindsey. Adams, it's not his fault because Jenkins failed. But look at Adams, he's out of position. He's out of position, yet he doesn't give up. He hustles, and he hunts down the running back. And it's a big game by the Broncos, but that hustle is amazing, and every defender should be like that. As a former safety myself, Jamal Adams, to me, is the best edge run support safety in the NFL. Now, a little secret that people don't know is he has upped his game on as a deep half safety this year. Look at this example against the Colts. Uh, Jets are playing a cover two sink, cover two sag, what have you. His first read is the slot, is the tight end. Slow motion. Now watch it right here. He literally breaks out of his back pedal at the same exact time luck is ready to hit the seam over the second level boom perfect timing now this is free safety talent even though adams is a strong safety he is showing free safety talent as well in the passing game this year and it's huge for this jets defense here's another uh deep half example free safety example for jamal adams there he is, the near side safety, too deep. Uh, the Jets actually run a cover four here. So the corners and the two safeties each have their fourth deep zone. Three underneath, four-man rush. There's Jamal Adams' first, second, and third read. His first read is the slot tight end. That's the man he, he really needs to look out for. If he stays short, he goes to the second read. Look at Jamal, backpedal, backpedal, backpedal. Opens his hips right there at the exact same time. See, see his hips there opened up the exact same time. His first read makes an outbreak, and Andrew Luck loads it up. Johnny on the spot, out of the back pedal, bursts forward. It's not the greatest coverage in the world, but it's a great read. Remember, he's cover four. He's deep, but he pounces on the first read quickly, and it's a good job. <laughs> 